Hello and welcome to RimWorld, episode 10 this time. My name is Phoenix. We're going to continue our struggle with this colony. Tiger is still suffering from malaria. It's a major, but she developed immunity now, so it should be fine. She's a medium pain, but she will get over it eventually. How is doing Jayman? Jayman got over it completely, and he has no effects at all from it. So I'm happy with the way he has done so far. Okay. So we have few things to do in here. Of course the first thing they're going to clean because that's what they tend to do. But I think slowly we'll have to work on the paths as well. At some point we'll have to build the path to here. Just through all these trees. And the visitors are leaving us so that's fine. Now we're going to wait for a... Okay, Vassalo is doing research this time. We have a few people doing research. And we're officially out of power. The moon is in an eclipse. That is a problem. So... It will cause some problems for us. But hopefully nobody is going to raid us at the moment. And we will be able to deal with it. Let's have a look. I'm the stones, so let's pick up some from here as well if we have to. Okay, we've done the research. We have a hospital bed now. So let's go to research screen and let's think what we can get. We could get machining. Or a carpet making. We can get a carpet making just quickly because it's easy research. And we'll be able to build some carpets in our base. In the meantime, we can go to structures and we can find the hospital bed. So let me think. Hospital beds, okay. And I would like them just a normal wooden bed. And let's think how we're going to arrange them. If we put the. put them like that. Then they have access to our guys from all the places, really. Okay, we'll have to move this door. Because that's obvious that it's not going to work for us. And we can have two beds in here. Okay, so we're going to sell the door and sell this wall. And that's fine. Okay, so you get rid of the door. And we need wooden door again. Just moved it in here. The stone blocks, we'll put it here. We'll drag it there as well. Okay, we can leave it like that, I think. Yeah, well, we can leave it like that. And we'll have to have some lamps as well. Let's go to structures. Power. No power. Uh, furniture. And the standing lamp as well. I think if we have two lamps in here, that should be alright. We can have one in here and the other one in here. And after that, we can have a zone as well. And that's going to be a zone like that. And we have to put the storage in here. So we'll have medicine in here. And nothing else. Okay. So it's going to go like that. And the only thing we want here to use medicine, I think. And body parts as well. Because apart of that, nothing I think it goes. Let me just check. Our body parts, the prosthetics as well. They are. Okay, so we'll, yeah, we'll keep it like that. Medicine and body parts will be stored in here, in case we need to do any operations or anything with the people. And they should build the hospital walls around it as well. 
Okay, Perl is going to work on these uh, stones and producing the bricks for us. And the rest of the guys should actually haul other things to the base. Am I actually building the proper wall? Let me have a look at power. Yep, that's okay. Is the wall in here? It is, okay. Okay, we got the power back. That should be alright now then. They should nicely store the energy quickly. Just to make it easier for them, let's switch it off in the bedrooms for now. They are going to use the bedrooms at the moment. Okay. So yeah, everyone is going to be building things. After with the carpet, we'll put some carpet in here, we'll put some decorations just to make it a little bit better for them and make the living conditions easier for the guys. Okay, I'm quite happy with the way the things are going. The only thing I'm afraid now, because we're getting value, uh, wealth day by day, and it will become dangerous. They will actually raid us more. And we also run out of stone, uh, metal by the looks of it. So I see the hospital beds took a fair chunk of this metal from us. Research table again. And what can we get? Electric smelting or machining or tailoring. We could go with machining. Because we have two mechanoids dead, and we can use them for pro pro uh, ingredients like metal and stuff. So we can just break them in the body parts. Navy scientist is visiting colony. That's fine, I don't care about him. He can visit. Okay, they're moving the chunks, so I'm glad that we're actually moving things. Some more chunks in here, and some food in here as well. So it's not too bad. How is the power? The power is not too great, to be honest. I could actually do with one or two extra power plants. So I think we'll go and do that. So let's go to power. Solar generator. And we can't place it here, so we'll have to place it there. So let me think how we're going to do it. I want this path clear as possible. So let's place the solar generator in here and in here and just connect them to the, to the grid. We didn't discover anything here, so that's not the... That's how I wanted it really. But hey. Okay. We'll have to actually build one more room in here, I think. So, one, one, two, three, four, five. We want dig, and they, that will create some materials for us as well. I want to haul these things from here as well. Okay. Will you actually find some metal for us, guys, or not? Looks like they're not going to find anything. But at least now, with five guys we have, everything is going much faster. Just howl them as well, because they will slow you down. Okay. Why are we running low on food? Anyone? We have seven meals, so it's okay. Not a big problem, really. This thing is set with the high priority and nobody actually bothered to move medicines for us. Because we haven't used them all. So I don't know what happened to medicines. Well that's fine guys, you can move things around. She's still building the bricks blocks, so we actually have brick, blo brick blocks. The only thing we are missing now is this bloody metal. So I think we have to actually go and find it somewhere here. 
Okay, some silver I could unlock, but I don't want to. Okay, there is a metal ore. So you guys can dig that for me. And that's going to be your mission. Okay. Quite fun how they leave the footprints there. Okay, so we have some metals in here now. Okay, we'll have to go on speed free and let them actually dig all of it. Okay, we've done the research with machining. So let's go to another one. Gun turret cooling we could go or tailoring. I think we could go with tailoring for this time. Well, that should be fine. We will be able to make things of this uh, cloth we collected in here. I want to think where we can place the machining table. So let's go production. A machining table we can place in here. Okay, so that's going to be a machining table. But we need metal for it, of course. And that's one of the things we don't have. Ah. If we got some trade around, we could actually sell things and buy some metal. Okay, they're they picking this metal from here, so it, eventually they will actually move it around. But I would prefer if everyone was actually mining it, so let's move everyone. We'll move them to level 1 and everyone level 2. That way they will prioritize mining over everything else. And we will get these things done. Okay, go. You see, that way it's going to go faster, guys. And on speed free, it actually goes reasonably quick. If you could move the metal with you guys. It's even very clever because on the way back they could easily pick up the metal and put it in the stock, but they don't. Okay. So what do we use in metal for at the moment? Not much. Are they going to dig again? They are. Okay. Let's just give them some more orders to dig this metal. Okay, finally we finished. The guys are actually going to move this metal from here, and they are. We should be able to be build few things around. What are we starting with? We're starting with hospital beds by the looks of it. I think I've built too many of them to start with because we don't even have that many colonies, but I wanted to have it prepared for a bigger numbers. I'm building the walls as well, so that's good. And Goror is researching again. Okay. This thing is a marble. There is some things in here. Let's see where it goes. So let's claim it. And now we can uh, deconstruct it. And we'll see what happens to it. If anyone actually bothers to do anything with it. Okay, we have some more. So let's deconstruct. Well, that was a bit wasted effort. It didn't lead to anything. Just dig this tiny corridor in here. I was hoping that I will at least get some metal, but no. The only thing we got from that is some bricks. And bricks are the only thing that we have plenty of. So we have to wait for metal. Machining table is not even started. I think it's pearl. Okay, you can't even start the blueprint on it. Well, it's not going the best. 
So what are you doing? You bring in some metals for us. And you're going to put it on the beds. Okay. So that's a bit of work we have. And what's going on? They arrived in a drop pod. And it's a mechanoid again. Oh, it's two of them this time. Okay, that's maybe a problem. So let's turn all the turrets on. And let's move our guys as well, I think. Because we may need some extra power in here now. Okay, go! Okay, they're coming as well, so it may be a to hurry up. You can go there. Do you have actually a weapon? Gora, you don't have a weapon, so you get out. Taylor, you have a weapon. You go there. Who is there? Vassalo, you have a pistol. Okay. Gora doesn't. Tiger does. You go there. Okay. Jayman, you go there. Okay, everyone is in a position. We should get it sorted. Okay. We actually are shooting quite nicely. Okay. Depends what they focus on. If they focus on us, we are in trouble. Alright, nobody got injured, I think. I know I keep telling you guys they are actually really difficult to deal with, so we are lucky. And you probably don't believe me now because we win every single time. Nobody got injured. You have this malaria, but you are cured of it. Yeah. Okay, it went really nice. Okay. I can't unlock it for some reason. Okay, you go and unlock. You're unlocked, why aren't you not? I have no idea. Yeah, never mind, okay. We are actually going to move them around. You didn't drop anything, did you? You don't have weapons or anything like that. Okay. Well... If we had a machining table, we would actually get some metal, but we don't. If the travelers visiting colony, we don't care about them. Now we finish tailoring, okay. Electric smelting, we can go with that. Yep, yeah. electric smelting should actually work quite fine for us. Oh, they dropped some metal, okay. Not I dropped much. But better than nothing. Reauthorized machining table. Okay. I think what we're going to do, we're going to cancel the beds for now. We'll build them later. Just like that. Because machining table will allow us to do everything. So Vasalo, you build machining table. Or whoever wakes up will build machining table. Tiger, it's going to be your job. So Tiger, go with that. Okay. So now machining table is connected. We can set the bill. Is machine table connected? It is. Don't know where, but it is. Look at the power. Okay, it's connected there, so that's fine. Okay. So the build on the machine table is going to be disable mechanoids, and you do it continuously. I'm going to create a zone as well. It's always good to have zones. 
and that's going to be a zone with mechanoid corpses. So let's disable everything but the corpses. And we want mechanoid corpses here and critical. Okay, let's have a look how it works. Tiger. Pre-authorize disable mecha uh, mechanoid corpses. If we go to config as well. Take the best stockpile. Yeah, you can do that. Yeah, you can do. How much meta? 22, that's not bad. Okay. We are actually gaining metal from it, so that's fine. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed the episode. We actually did quite a lot in this episode, and I'm impressed. Thank you guys for watching. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And uh, don't forget to follow me on, on Twitter for more of my videos and more of the information about the India development games that I share on my Twitter. So thanks again and see you guys next time.